Okay, at this point in my first video, I've shown you where to connect the 0.01 microfarad capacitor and how to take it to the back panel. In this video, we'll see how well that does using the Tremino software and this cesium-137 source. I'm going to put the source into the sample stand and let's count how active it is on the third or fourth or fifth tier down. So fifth tier down. So the output from the 0.01 microfarad capacitor, which is coupled to the output of the first preamp stage, is going to my line in of my sound card on my computer. So I'm going to move this over here now where I have the Tormino, Thermino, sorry about the pronunciation there, the Thermino, if that's correct, software queued up. Now I'm going to, it's just queued up in the stock form. I have preset it a little bit, but I'm going to go ahead and start making the measurement with the cesium-137 source. Uh, I'm not getting anything at all. Well, I guess I better plug the sound card in since I forgot to do that. Okay, here we go. Sorry about that. <laughs> So anyway, with the cesium-137 source, we should get a peak at about 661 and a peak at about, um, let's see, the peaks are 661 and 31.8 keV. So right now we're starting to see real good peaks here. I need a little touch up here on this one. But there we are. CS137 one peak and CS137 peak number two. And uh, it's got about 50,000 counts in one minute. So that's the activity of the source at this setting. So as you can see right here, uh, we're getting the perfect example of what we would expect to get from that calibration standard. So just for ducks here, I'll switch over to a different standard. It's not a standard, but this is a good test. I'll put in a source out of a smoke detector and uh, we'll dump that in here and this should give me a peak, possibly two peaks in gamma, although its primary output of course is alpha particles. Um, there are two gamma peaks one strong one and one weak one that will show up and uh, uh, the 241 peak is at 69.77 and uh, let's see it's going to be about uh, 26.34 I don't have the software adjusted to show that perfectly but as you can see the peaks we're getting are nice and clean and exactly what we would expect out of that source so that 0.01 microfarad capacitor and jack on the back panel fit into your sound card are capable of giving you excellent home multi-channel analyzer spectrum from gamma sources uh, for two dollars you just can't beat it and it's a good repurposing of a great old 80s nuclear scaler. Just doesn't get any better than that.